If you're looking for a winner for a love Looking for a dance Looking for supreme Looking for a queen memory card for my camera to my computer so I'm vlogging off my phone again which is so annoying because I hate the quality on here and it's really really low sounding so hopefully you guys can hear me um, I'm just gonna vlog for the morning on my phone until I can get my memory card so right now it's Saturday and we're going to his mom's um, black history event or something like that at um, a library so I'm gonna see his mom um, I haven't seen her the whole time I was here so it's probably gonna be the only time I get to see her and then I'm also gonna see his little brother Jojo he's not his blood brother he's adopted but um yeah he's so cute he's gonna be shy watch I know he's gonna be so shy you see you know he can only talk to you on the video in person he's gonna be like I'm scared He's still yeah. shy. He doesn't even talk to me in the video. But yeah, so we're going over there right now. And yeah, so I'll see you guys when we get there. You want to say hi to the vlog? What up? What's, what's happening? My damn YouTube world in comments. <laughs> Texas, all blacks, no Mexicans, you know. There's no Mexican, that's what they say? Yeah, there's Mexicans, but this is a slogan. I mean, when I was coming up, we went that many Mexicans out here. Oh. Yeah, Acres Home is the largest uh, black community uh, west of the Mississippi River. Over like 150,000 total population right here. So, yeah, I told him to bring me. Yeah, Acres Home. Uh, Slim Thug can't make his home. Mike Jones can't make his home. Mike Jones? It's hard to Mike think people Jones. that can't make his home. Uh, Loretta Devine, the actress from Hager's Homes. The new Mary Houston, Sylvester Turner from Hager's Homes. I know a lot of celebrities and shit is from Hager's Homes. I just can't pinpoint them right now on the top of my head. I told him to bring me to the most gangster, the most hood part of Hager's Homes. So. I want to see the hood. I want to see the hood. I want to see the trap. Like hoods are just so much more different, like here than in Toronto. We don't really have hoods. We just have like little you patches, that little has. patches of areas where it's like the hood. This is like, it seems like the whole neighborhood. Yeah, shit, everybody the whole area. Play, they play. So this is it right here. Mm -hmm. That's the rental office. This is Garden City. I wouldn't say I would say it's. Good as part. Uh -oh. Nice apartment. I think it was apartment 59. I want to pull into it, but this is actually. No, no, no. We don't have to pull in. Man, I, I'm really just <laughs> no. Like, I like. I used to play in this grass right here. I used to play in this grass right here. Tripping. See, 69. That's my aunt saying. She died and she took care of me. I used to play football back here. You know, one end to the other it was uh, a touchdown and shit. So this is just like one of the hoods. Yeah, I mean, it's like a whole bunch of apartments and they're just like this. And he told me that they ride horses here. When he yeah, told me they horses. ride horses, I could not believe it. You ride horses out here, they get hard. Oh my gosh. That's so weird to me. Is, is it because they're, they live in Texas? Is that why? What you mean? Is that why you guys well, can we ride do, horses? We do, we do a lot of trail rides, which consists of uh, trail rides, like people ride horses and shit. People have horses in their backyard. A lot of stuff. Oh. So a lot of these houses out here are built on like privately owned land. So houses are not unison like you would see in the neighborhood. Like yeah. Every third. 
third house is the same. Oh my gosh, there's a horse right there. Yeah, there's a church actually right here. And uh, they probably got a funeral for somebody. And they got the uh, carriage. Uh, oh my gosh, uh, wow. I have not seen this. This is so Texas or something. They get carried by wow. a horse today. today. Why do I feel like I'm like a tourist taking mm -hmm. pictures <laughs> and videoing this? This is so funny. But I am a tourist. up a few things from Target and I got some poop earrings because I've been dying without them. I'm hungry so I'm about to try to find some place for us to eat if it is fast or if we have to sit down. Yeah I'm starving too. I didn't eat yet all day so the plan is to go eat. Oh, guys so I'm in Chili's right now and I'm I'm in the bathroom trying to wash my hands and there was a lady in front of me and she turns around, she's just like, oh my gosh. And she's like, Missy, I watch you. It was so cute. But anyways, yeah. I met a subscriber and she was so nice. Her name is Frida. So if you're watching this, Frida, hey girl. <laughs> but yeah. Um, anyways, I'm in Chili's right now and ordered some food. Oh. Yeah, I got my same. What did I get? Mango. Mango. Mango habanero. chili chicken or something. Yeah. Mango chili chicken. Yeah, it's gonna be good. You know, I got the steak. Steak, mashed potatoes, and macaroni and cheese. So Southern, Texas. you know they're gonna put some chives in there. So she want me to eat some greens. <laughs> they just finished her drink. You know, I got mine to go, but uh. I'm about to leave here and head to the house. We've been out all day. We got the exact same thing at Chili's uh, that we got last time. Uh, uh, ooh. Get the phone, man. <laughs> Jeez, I'm so full. Yeah, I am too. My hair didn't dry today, so I have to do this style and like my hair's all frizzy. I'm pretty upset because I just washed it. Dream. I just washed my hair and I wanted it to dream, come out really perfect, dream, but dream. no, it did not. And you guys are laughing on the other vlog about <laughs> Dear, Dear Titty, Titty Milk. milk. <laughs> he always says the weirdest, stupidest, funniest things ever. It's so funny. I don't know where he comes up with his disses, but off it was the, pretty funny. Off the top of the dog, man. <laughs> I'm a character. Yeah. I really want to get McDonald's cookies again. Hey, uh, follow me on YouTube. Subscribe to my channel. I don't have a channel. He don't have a channel. Yeah, dude. He should have a channel, it's but like comedy WW or something. It's called WWTG. So I finally got my camera back, finally. So I'm vlogging on my digital camera. This time reminds him of me. Hey, hey, hey. People fall in love in mysterious ways. Maybe just na, 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 na. That's when you don't know the words. But we are in love with you every single day. So, honey, now take me to the into your open arms. Take me to your loving arms. Love it. Hey. Maybe we. Anyway, y'all, I'm taking her to McDonald's to get us some cookies for, uh, for reasons I don't know. I've been craving cookies and chocolatey stuff for the past, I don't even know, a couple days. Like, ever since I've been on my period. And craving. I, I feel like this has not happened to me. But I'm craving chocolate cookies for McDonald's right now. And he's going to bring me there. We just got home and I said... We just got home, she had to pee, so we passed three McDonald's to get home and she didn't open her mouth and say she wanted because to Because I had to pee so badly, he had me waiting in the car, I'm like, 
So you know moving when you, all around. You know when you finally get home after being out, and you're like, man, I can't wait to be home. I wanted to chill at home too, but I really wanted the cookies. So I'm like, bro, you don't really want no cookies. I really want the cookies. <laughs> so how does this song remind me, remind you of me? If you don't even know the words. Because I was eating at this restaurant and I was texting you and Buka de Beppo. Because he was good as hell. And you know, I was thinking about you, but this uh, song was playing in like the background. And he was like, loving you till 70. Like, you don't love me till I'm 70? Uh, what do you mean? Uh, <laughs> are you gonna love me till I'm 70? Till you're 70, yeah. I'm only gonna live till like 72. <laughs> That's, the, that's when I set the limit on when I was a little kid. I was like, guy, just give me at least till I'm 72 and I'll be happy. I don't want to be in the bed with my knees touching my chest. Fuck that. Have to break my ass down in the casket. No, sir. Let me just fall down a flight of stairs at 70. So. Hey. Gosh, is McDonald's that far? Yeah, yeah, what you mean, huh? So lonely. McDonald's, here we come. I'm with so spoiled. Shanice Parkin, aka Natural. Nice. Yeah, that is. I'm so spoiled though. He gives me like almost, almost whatever I want. Right? You telling me that? Don't you give me like almost whatever yeah, I want? That tour guy ain't no sim. That doesn't mean you're a sim, but you just yeah. love me. I give you a little something, something. Bye. All right, so we're just pulling up to McDonald's. For the cookies, though. You know, every time I go to McDonald's, I always be like, suck it easy. Why? They be like, thank you, sir. I don't really? know, just to fucking play with people. Because they be thinking I'm saying, take it easy. <laughs> so I'm going to show you how it's done. Don't say that. It's so nice. Anyway, so you guys probably seen the other clip that we went out to eat. We went to the Galleria Mall, and then we went to... Kona Grill. Kona Grill, just to have some drinks and food. And they took forever to even come serve us, like 30 minutes. Then it took us like another... 45 minutes to get our food and stuff. So we got everything for free. And yeah. So now I'm just wanting dessert and I want cookies for McDonald's. Look, mom, I'm on cops with my distorted face. <laughs> what? You're silly. Yo, where's the damn lady or the man who made the yum cookie there? Wow. Yes, uh, can I get like four cookies from you? What chocolate candy? Nah, four cookies. Four cookies, alright. What kind of cookies? Just the chocolate chip, but can can I get them warmed up? And what else? That's it. The speech you're making for them. Wagwan. What? Wagwan. <laughs> Say something else. Uh, police, politician, me not trust none of them blood clot that I boy that boy. What? That's from uh, that sounds just shot some shots. Shots, yeah. <laughs> that sounds horrible. Let me tell you something. Yeah. Max, do him. <laughs> You're funny. Take the weed and lead a what? <laughs> I'm surprised you watch Shatters. Shatters is my movie. That's like the gangsters movie. Everybody I ever saw loves Shatters. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah. And from everywhere, Burr. everybody loves Shatters. And Mad Max was like on the refrigerator and he wrote like, I thought he was at like nine kills and he put a three in front of that house. I was like, oh. <laughs> got my McDonald's cookies. Warmed boy got a, up. Boy, I got them a Sunday. No, you got ice cream and nuts. Mm. So, so good. Hey guys, so I just made it home now. Um, took off all my makeup. And I just twisted up my hair because I plan on doing probably another photo shoot tomorrow. I might film a video, I'm still debating. Um, I want to start back with my curly chats again where you guys ask me all your different questions about, you know, your hair, the problems you're having. And if you guys want to ask me any personal questions, just 
I'll throw a few in there as well. And yeah, so I want my hair to look kind of good. So I'll just put in a couple chunky twists. And I used um, Shea Moisture. I used the Shea Moisture Coconut Hibiscus Curl Milk. Um, yeah, I don't really use this. I just bought this like a, like probably like the second time I ever came to Houston, and I just keep it here just to use, so I don't have to always bring products with me. So yeah, I have that, um, and still have my cookies. I still have like two cookies left, but. I'm over that now. I think I'm going to make myself a sandwich, a turkey sandwich, because I'm kind of hungry. Um, and then probably after this, I'm just going to go lay down and edit my vlog, which has to go up tomorrow. I'm going to try to get it done tonight so it can go up by the morning. Uh, right now, it's time to it? Right now, it's 11.43 p.m., so I don't know if I'm going to finish, but I'm going to try to finish. Um, usually, I don't know, for some reason, when I'm here, I think because he goes to sleep so, so early, that I go to sleep early too. Usually when I'm at home, I go to sleep at like 3 a.m., 2 a.m., 4 a.m. When I'm here, I go to sleep at like 12. <laughs> like, cause he be he'll he'll be in bed by like 10 o'clock. So, yeah. <laughs> Yesterday was Saturday night, and we went to bed so freaking early. We went to bed cause we went to Chili's. We came home from Chili's. I had the itis. So I'm like, I want to take a nap. Let's take a nap. I went into bed by like 7.30, fell asleep probably by like 8.30, and we and I said, okay, I'm going to set the alarm for 9.30, slept right through the alarm, it kept going off, kept putting it off, putting it off, and then yeah, we ended up waking up at 6.30 a.m. today, so <laughs> yeah, we didn't do anything last night, we were going to go out, but that didn't happen, and a lot of you guys are probably wondering like, when are you going to go home, Shanice? When are you going to go home? You've been here forever. I know I've been here forever. I feel like I've been here forever. And I want to go home because I want my bed. And I want my tea. And I miss my little sister. But I just booked my ticket. Because I only got a one way to come here. Because sometimes when I get like a round trip, like I never want to go home at that time. So I kind of regret it. So this time I got a one way and then it was so expensive during the month of February to go home so I'm like no I'm not going home in February I was supposed to actually go home February 26th but too expensive so I booked my trip for I booked my one way to go back home on Thursday March 3rd I think it's March 3rd so March 3rd I'll be going back home March 3rd I'm going back home I'll be home for like 11 12 days and then I'll be coming back here because I'm going to BeautyCon Dallas and I'm like I'm not paying 600 something dollars to go to beauty con Dallas for a couple days and then go come back home So what I'm gonna do is I'm coming out here to Houston and then I'm coming here on the 14th Staying and then we're gonna drive down to Dallas on the for the 17th where I'm gonna show with um, Ashley um, Miss Fabulous Teaks ah, Miriam and girls and um He's gonna stay with his friends and then on the Sunday we're gonna drive back here and then I'll be leaving on the 24th. So I'm only gonna be home for like 10, 11 days, but that gives me time to do my nails like cause it's all growing. It can give me time to do my nails, do my waxing, just to be home in my own bed, get some videos in and all that. I'm gonna go ham when I get home. Like I'm gonna make videos and videos and videos and just be working because I've been playing a lot, you know? Play as well. So gotta do more work in. <laughs> So yeah, I guess that's everything I wanted to share with you guys right now. Probably talk to you guys more about like BeautyCon and Europe in another vlog. So yeah, I'll see you guys all in Friday's vlog. <sighs> Later.